Good morning. Today is Tuesday, August 28, 2012. Today we have three segments for you. We are going to talk about philosophy, we are going to talk about art, and then we are going to talk about a movie pick. Alright, our first subject today is going to be philosophy. We're going to talk about three reasons why Aristotle is wrong, and a general rule of thumb when you're talking about philosophy, Aristotle is wrong. Reason number one. Aristotle thought that when you had two objects of different masses, that when you dropped them, the object with a heavier mass would hit the ground first. However, this is wrong. The mass of an object does not affect how quickly it accelerates due to gravity. Reason number two. Aristotle thought that flies had four legs. He was so trusted in his time that no one bothered checking, and flies have six legs. Reason number three. Aristotle said that we have five senses. However, we have ten. We have the sense of hearing, we have the sense of smelling, we have the sense of tasting, and we have the sense of seeing. We also have the sense of balance and the sense of motion. However, whenever you start talking about touch, it's actually four different senses. We can sense heat, and we can sense pressure, and we can sense pain, and we can also sense cold. Um, these all use four different nerves, so they're all four different senses. Today we have an, arti an artist slash photographer named Thomas Allen. He's taken photos of cutouts from encyclopedias and other books, and you can see them on the screen right now. And if you want to find out more information about Thomas Allen, I will leave a link below to his website. For segment number three today, we are going to do a film pick. Um, this week we are going to watch um, Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind. It is an older indie film with Jim Carrey in it, and it's lots of fun to watch, and you can go watch that on Netflix. I'm not sure where else you can find it, but I'm sure you can find it other places than that. Thank you for joining me today on Tea Time with Matthew. All the important links will be down below, and I will see you next week.